buy it, use it, break it, fix it, trash it, change it. Do you think these people are listening to AM radio? We certainly don't. Most people don't even give AM a chance. Take this gentleman, for example. It's only on the AM tuner for literally a second before he switches to satellite. Is this something you would do too? On AM, I listen to 660 WFAN and also uh, 880 uh, when they uh, broadcast the Yankee games. Now Rivera is set. And here's the payoff. Swung on and grounded to second. Cano fields, throws to first, in time. Ball game over. World Series over. Yankees win. The Yankees win. And so uh, I can remember driving back from the shore with my parents in the back of the old Plymouth listening to uh, uh, not so much Amos and Andy, but I do remember listening to things like, uh, like The Shadow, um, The Lone Ranger, uh, The Green Hornet. Those kinds of programs were things that I do remember listening to uh, from the golden age of radio. Who knows what evil lurks in the hearts of men? <laughs> A shadow knows. Blue Cold presents The Shadow. AM radio and its future is kind of in its own hands. Um, it could, for example, I feel like this station has a bright future and stations who would operate this way and serve the community and can be creative and, and flexible and, and have dedicated ownership and talented staff, I feel like they could flourish and do really, really well. When you switch over to AM, I think that the, the cracking and popping that's, that's been there for generations is all of a sudden bothering me a lot more than it used to. And I think that uh, if I'm going to continue to listen to AM radio, it, could, it probably will only be if I pick up an HD radio. I know you want to leave me, but I refuse to let you go. If I have to beg, please, for your sympathy, I don't mind, because you mean that. Shouldn't that classic song sound like this? I know you want to leave me. High-definition satellite signals are extremely unreliable during inclement weather. Is having HD radio's variety and sound quality worth losing reception whenever there's a storm? This is something most HD radio users ask themselves before purchasing. The future of AM radio is it's going to die in about 15 years. Um, simply because the technology is 100 years old, it can't compete with FM analog, it can't compete with FM digital, it can't compete with digital anything, period. Anyone who thinks that AM has a future, is, I want what they're smoking. It seems as if satellite radio may be leading the radio industry into a new revolution. A generation of high quality sound with endless variety. But what lay in store for AM radio? AM and FM is what I listen to all the time, so AM, I listen to about half the time at AM, so be upset because I can't afford to like get Sirius or XM radio, so I, I really want to see AM stay. <laughs>